Hey there, it's me, Katie Beth, again. <laughs> and here's Josh. Josh, what's your screen name or YouTube name? Uh, Stage Tech Six Six Six. And what what is the genre of your channel? If anyone wants to watch it, uh, motorcycle vlogs and Jeep trips, trails, and that's about it. Uh, today we're gonna try this wine that I bought. The story behind it is that I went to the store to get some change for my um, what's it called? Like when people laser laser hair removal people and you tip them money so i needed money to tip them and so i went into the store to get a pack of gum so i could pull out money and then i saw this and it had a sign underneath it that said like sale 9.99 and i really like this bottle i don't actually like wine but uh i thought i could at least dump out the wine and keep the bottle and I was talking to the cashier people and didn't even pay attention to when i was buying it how much it was and then i left and like driving down the road later and I looked at the receipt and it was $40. So the sale price of $9.99 was not for this. It was like a single bottle of wine that was sitting on the floor. So uh, now I have this bottle, but um, for $40, I feel like I need to drink it instead of just putting it down the sink. Oh, P.S. I wanted this bottle so I can uh, take this label off and put some uh, mouthwash in it for my bathroom. Okay, so we're going to open this up and try it out. Do you okay. even like wine? Uh, kind of. Okay. Because I will be not be a good judge of anything of how this works. I can't tell you what the names are, but I can tell you if it's delicious or not. This looks pink, so I think it's a rosé. But I also don't like rosés. Because, <laughs> <laughs> because I got Angry Orchard rosé flavor and it... Ooh. Oh, that's like a really nice little... That'll be very nice for my mouthwash. <laughs> You can smell it already. It smells like wine. It smells good, actually. Really? Yeah. You're that kind of alcoholic. Uh, yeah. <laughs> okay, so wine, do I have to pour it like beer so it doesn't get frothy at the top, or does it not matter how you pour wine? Uh, I usually pour it tilted like... This like, is really heavy. Like my arm... <laughs> my arm shaking trying you. to pour it. I mean, it'll work. Do you want like this much? That would be fun. Or do you want like more? Because I'm going to need to get rid of it <laughs> anyway. I mean, I was going to say, we're going to we'll have to drink it, it eventually. <laughs> so I don't like, if I don't like this, my plan was just to keep pouring you some and then I'll drink this other <laughs> cider stuff I bought. I see what you did there. <sighs> Tastes like college. Tastes like college when you're just drinking everything. I don't know. I didn't go to college. Oh. Well, real college. No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, how does it taste to you? It. I want to say cherry, but I don't think that's cherry. Uh, it's red rose. Rose. I actually don't know what rose. I don't know. Eh. Okay, let's keep drinking. <laughs> It's not bad. I can keep drinking it. Wine's not like totally my thing. But uh, while we drink this bottle, we're also gonna work on making these friendship bracelets. <laughs> I got this at Michael's when I was there and I had a coupon. Cause again, when you have a coupon at Michael's, I have to get something. So we're gonna break these out and dry them out. <laughs> so first we poured a little more wine. And now we ripped them open, and actually more came in this pack than I would think, since I got it for about five bucks after the coupon. Uh, there's eight of them. So I tried it first without using the instructions, and it uh, just completely came undone. So then we did try to use the instructions, and this is the one we tried the instructions on. So you have to do a little flip, and I just uh, did not work. It's supposed to be all of the nice side leather on one side and all of the not nice side, nice side on the other. Um, but I... Oh, and here I did try to do it again to see if it would fix itself, and it just made it uglier. But I still can snap it and make it into a bracelet, so that part kind of worked. Other than that, we kind of completely failed. And Josh tried it too. It wasn't just me. Uh, that was his try. So, Josh, what do you think of this wine? It was... Wine? Whiny. That was wine. <laughs> uh, so, we have the bottle empty now. 
And uh, I'm going to try to use some acetone to get this label off. Let's see. So I got some acetone. Wait. I actually didn't check if this nail polish <laughs> remover has acetone <laughs> in it. Yeah, acetone's the first ingredient. Usually. Well, some a lot of nail polishes now are acetone-free. Is it really? Yeah, like they still work. They're just acetone-free. Like that's their big thing since acetone is not good for your skin. Okay, so let's try it. I honestly thought this would work better. <laughs> <laughs> Kudos to this uh, labeling company. That's some good labeling. <laughs> Do you want to try it? <laughs> some good labeling, right? Definitely not coming off. How am I going to get that off? I guess my mouthwash is just going to be labeled JNSQ. <laughs> I don't know. If anyone has any... uh tips on how to get this label off that would be much helpful please comment below and tell me how to get this off is it etching it's a, it's on top it feels like it's on it top it feels like a sticker and it's not a sticker it's like some kind of overlay i just don't know what kind and then this thing i'm pretty sure i can just get off with a blow dryer or a heat gun it's just like the sticker that says it has 12.5% 12, 12 alcohol, <laughs> which I didn't know it said. Josh had to find it on the bottle. Uh, also, as far as our bracelets went, uh, this is as far as we got. So, kind of? Where's the original picture? And this is what they're supposed to look like. So not far off. Here, put one on. Is your arm too big? Mm, no. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, also not quite. Uh, <laughs> So not quite uh, as easy as we thought it would be, but we also weren't great at reading directions. And also, the more of the wine we drank, the harder it was becoming <laughs> to try and read directions. This also stays on pretty well. Like just trying to get that off was quite a task. Uh, did you have anything else to mention? I mean, it tasted good, but that was probably because of the alcohol. Yeah. So, like, the more you drink, the better it tastes. Except in my case, because uh, it got warm and gross, and I actually didn't finish the last of it. <laughs> Alright, well, thanks for watching, everyone. Again, if you have any uh, comments or ideas on how to get this labeling off, I can't even scratch it off. Um, please comment below to help me out with this. But look at this flower. It's, like, really pretty, like an iridescent flower. Well, again, thanks for watching, everyone, and have a great night.